Paige Sutton led the Hardwood Hogs from 1974 to 1985 and brought the Razorbacks to nine NCAA tournament appearances. He's remembered as a Hall of Famer, a four-time Coach of the Year, and a loving family man. His former players looked back on his legacy and say his memory is a blessing. When you hear the word coach, there's just one and it was Eddie Sutton. You will meet many people who don't attribute Eddie Sutton with putting Arkansas basketball on the map. One, two, three, three, six. No one ever questioned Coach Sutton about what he was trying to teach us. He had a great command of knowledge of the game. And then he was able to convey that with an attitude of almost invincibility. And he was invincible. His coaching resume, the stuff of legend. He set the bar really, really high for coaches in this state. Tallying 806 wins, bringing four different schools to the NCAA tournament, earning four National Coach of the Year awards. Not one time, one game did we ever, ever feel like at halftime or whenever uh, that we were getting out coached. Though it took seven nominations, the Razorback coach finally getting a nod into the Naismith Hall of Fame this year. We all knew before he was officially in the Hall of Fame, that he was a Hall of Fame coach. A coach who helped the Hogs secure an astounding 120-8 and eight record in Fayetteville. Well, he was fair. I mean, and he and you knew coming in, uh, there was one goal. I mean, he was hard on you, but he was, he was hard the right way. After Arkansas, Sutton led Kentucky, and then his alma mater, Oklahoma State, where perhaps his most notable role came off the court leading the program in the aftermath of the 2001 OSU plane crash. Saturday night's tragedy took the lives of 10 people. Sutton served as a rock for the cowboy community, just as he did the Razorback. He just had a resiliency and a toughness about him and a, and a faith about him that was real and authentic. The man who revived Arkansas basketball, who made it cool to go to Arkansas basketball games again, who galvanized an entire state to support a program that had not previously been supported, who made generations of young men and women in the state of Arkansas grow up and want to be Razorbacks. A great coach, but a, but a better human. If I could be half the man he was, I'll be doing all right.